without me. I thought you cared about me. Must I go on pretending? Where is my happy ending? How was the job? It was fine, you know, until I figured out what to do with your life. No one ever does. Okay, what the hell is that? I found it on the train. I'm just gonna drop it off tomorrow. Oh, you're gonna you're gonna drop it off tomorrow? Are you insane? No, Erica, where I come from, that's what we do. Okay, this is Manhattan. You find a bag, you call Bomb Squad. Don't open that. Gross. A lottery ticket. Weird looking pills. Greta Hiddag. Let's see. No. Oh, here we go. Uh-uh. Yes. A spa day. Or we could do a colonic. Come on, it'll be fun. Will it be? Yeah. They jet asparagus juice up your ass, and it's not just about cleansing your body. It's also very good for short-term memory. Really? Mm-hmm. Jason Largo was dyslexic, and since he's been doing them, now he can say the alphabet backwards. Look, we're not taking her money, number one. And number two, I don't want asparagus juice shot up my butt under any circumstance. Never say never. Have you called your dad yet? <laughs> Do I have to? I just want him to think I'm not giving you the messages. Yeah, I know. I'll call him. Hey. Come on. Movie hasn't even started yet. I know, it's just... It was our thing, you know? Some crappy movie, just... Mom and I. Come on, Frankie. Let's get you home. You could always give me your mom. Ha, please take her. <laughs> Thank you. Cullen, I have a bag that I found that I think belongs to uh, Greta Hadag. Oh, uh, hi. 
Here you go. Oh, bless your heart. I've been looking everywhere. Where did you find it? Uh, on the subway. Oh, darling, you put it all the way in this rain. Would you like a, a cup of coffee? It's already on the pot. It, it would mean a lot to me. You've been so kind. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? You can put your umbrella here. Okay. Thank you. Are you from New York? Uh, no. I'm actually from Boston. But I'm living here with a friend. Boyfriend? No, my roommate from Smith. Her dad bought her a loft in Tribeca for graduation, so we're breaking it in. Oh, that must be tough. <laughs> the neighbors. I'm sorry. Remodeling. A little courtesy, please. A little quiet. Thank you. I swear they are building an ark. <laughs> Is this your husband? Yes, Christoph, when he was young. Mm. And is that your daughter? Yes, Nicola. He taught me how to play, my husband. Liszt was his favorite. Then he began fluffing the notes. His left hand. He thought it was arthritis. Six months later, he was gone. are with you and then they are gone, the ones we love. Liebestrom, do you know what it means? A dream of love, because that's all love leaves us with, a dream, a memory. my only company these days. Is that your dog? Oh, yes. Jojo. Long gone as well. Well, have you considered getting another? Oh, no, I couldn't. <laughs> I wouldn't know how to choose. Well, I could help you, if you wanted. Are you a dog person? A little bit. My mom actually used to breed them. Thank you, sweetheart, but I don't think I could manage a dog right now. I hope you are not offended. Not at all. But if you change your mind, just uh, let me know. Do I have your phone number? No. <laughs> I never know how to work these things. Here, let me help you. 